Caesar, and we're from the Pleasurable Branch of the Atlanta County Library System. Today we're going to show you three crafts to make at home. We have a Picasso portrait, scribble stones or gratitude rocks, uh, rock painting for kids. Black painting, that's right. And then we're going to do a Van Gogh sunflower painting. Our Inclusions in the gift bag. I think I'm gonna let you talk about it, Caesar. Okay. What's so what, is, what you'll be expecting in a bag like this one is of course the painting with which you can mix and match. For example, I use like a gray color like this one here. You can use black and white. Okay, you can you can be creative. You can you can do like uh, a bag like this, a car, or you can put your name in it. You can paint whatever you want to, and we also include this um, paint pen. Paint pen, so you can write. You can write with it. Okay. We also include in the bag, like the finished product, instruction, history of the painter, so to give you an idea. Okay. Okay, and here we also include the palette, so you can mix and match. Yes, the, right. The, the paints. The polished stone. Polished stone. And a smaller version of these large size canvases. These are five by seven in the gift bag, but you can also go and get a larger one at any store that sells arts and crafts. So we were thinking to ourselves, what can you create? We chose these books from the Pleasantville branch of the Atlanta County Library System, and we were inspired to make these crafts for spring summer. We chose a biography for, uh, about Picasso, which is down in front, from the 759 section. And there's also one for Van Gogh. And there's also, um, I believe, a couple, yeah. This one has a lot of art well, from the series. the series. Yeah, these two series are eyewitness books and artists in their time. And if you ask someone at the desk or come in, just look for the 759 section. So remember to try to draw new shapes using the circles and, and, and squares and shapes on anything that you can think of. For a gratitude rock, you'd put a word. word. For a scribble stone, it might be a, uh, a face or a ladybug. And these projects, you can be very creative. You can draw a circle and put a line through a crooked and then play with shapes for lips, Oops. eyes, nose, ears, mouth. And just have fun with it and enjoy it. So when you come in, ask for Caesar or myself, and we can set you up with your gift bag to take home with you. Hope to see you soon. Thank, Thank you. Thank you, guys. Have a good one. Have a good one.